Oh, should we weigh some kittens? Hi, Mom. Hi. Hello, pretty lady. Oh. Hello. Look at that little kitten. I want to see him. Oh, my goodness. Hi. You're so cute. Come here. Oh, sprinkles is so cute too. Hi, Trump. Trumpina. Trumpina, you're so adorable. Why did you get so dark? Oh, look at these little kittens. They're so darling. Hi, Mama. Oh, I don't even have any pictures. Oh my goodness. I haven't documented your adorableness today adequately. Oh. Hi, Mommy. What adorable babies you've made. So sleepy. Look at those keys. Hi, Mom. Hi. Are you going to sit in my lap during the way? That's nice. Pumpkin over there is so comfortable. Oh, and look at the little truffle. The little upside down truffle. Oh, sorry. What a good girl. Mommy is sitting in my lap. Mm, what a nice mama. What a nice mama. What a nice mama. Here comes the baby. And a pretty lady. A little pretty lady. <laughs> Snoodles. Look at Snoodles. Hi, Mama. Mama, I guess the hockey game must be over.
pray me. Woo! Pippi. Oh, cute. Hi, pumpkin. Pumpkin. Oh, truffle. You're so cute. Oh, it's so comfy to be upside down on this thing. Oh, hi, Treff. <coughs> Mommy. Let's get a picture of Sprinkle Tummy. Sprinkle Tummy. That's all I need. Who smells like poop? Oh my goodness. It's probably my camera. Bite yawn, anybody. I'm going to be ready to be laid out. Oh, get it. All right. I should weigh people. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Is today the 28th? February it is. Wow. Happy weekend, everybody. And happy 31st day birthday, kittens. Hi. Hey, Mama. Get him. Get him. Your sister. You need to do more to see. Oh, look at those big teeth. Look at those big teeth. All right. So cute. You're so cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, you're so cute. You're adorable. Okay, let's see. Uh, I don't know what that is. Oh my goodness. Let's see how big the let's see how big Thumpy Butt is. 
I have a feeling that mummy is trying to win them. And although they're not interested in food just yet, Truffle did eat some tibbles when we gave them to her. Uh, Praline is 22 and a half. There is usually a period of a few days when the weight does not, the weight may plateau when the weaning starts um, as they're figuring out the transition. Um, and then once they start eating solid food, then it skyrockets usually. Oh, look at you little scamp. Pumpkin. Hmm. So pumpkin. Twenty and Have you seen the incredible scampering? Oh my goodness, they're so fast. Val, 23 and a half. That seems like a big boy. Depends on how We'll start trying to get them started on this guy. Oh, look. That was busy. What do you think? He's like, I was just, I was just so close to the milk bar, and then you grabbed me, and then now I just want to go back. And me has to go potty. See if she figures out where to go. Just a little, a little pee at time. <laughs> I can't believe how big they are. Who have I lost? That was Truffle. Did Truffle just go scampering off. Hey, Truffs, come here. Let me weigh you first. Truffy Truffs. So cute. Uh, 20 and three quarters. Truffles. Truffle. Her name is actually Truffle. I call her Truffles. I don't know. I don't know why. Because she's so cute. That's why. Let's see if the Truffle would like a little smidge of... What do you think about this? Probably not. She's pretty busy. Oh, whoa. It seemed like she was almost going to take a big bite. What do you think, Chops? What do you think? Or sometimes if you put it on your... This is why I smell like food all the time. You smell that? <laughs> nope, not interested. She did eat some kibble. Chubs. Hey Chubs. Are you ever gonna be interested in this stuff? Oh. His his nostril is going. What do you think if I put some on your face? Oh, that's not so bad, huh? Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Sprinkle. Sprinkle. I have my food delivered via milk bar. Nope, not interested. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> have I not done? is 21 and the quarter wait no 22 no helping 22 and a quarter and big boy Oh boy, the um, black kittens are all over the place. So I think that uh, you you see uh, the door has been open to the office ever since she tried to jump with them, and um, she still picks them up and moves them around. Um, I don't know if you saw her, the snickerdoodle when he got dunked in the water bowl and just moved a few feet away for no reason. Um, she's been moving them just outside the bathroom to nurse, like two at a, one or two at a time, which I think might be part of her special weaning process. Maybe she does it so that she's not coming in here and overrun by kittens doing uh, milk bar battles, um, since they have pretty sharp teeth now. Sprinkles is big boy. 24 and 5 eighths. But I don't think she's spending as much time uh, letting them nurse. At least not all at the same time. I think she's doing shifts. So it will be interesting to see if they actually interested in food. They're, they're all drinking water. Sprinkles is drinking water right now. Oh. Big boy. Um. Baby, you have to pee. Oh, get it. You. What's she doing now? Putting in a bowl. I think she has a pee. Right, pee. There she's going. Good girl. What a good girl. What a good girl. Good girl. They usually won't start pooping on their own until they eat solid food. Good 
good girl. She's still burying. Nowhere near where she be, but she's Oh my goodness, look at this sprinkle. Oh, he's so big. He's so big. Oh. When you were born, I thought you were black with a white face. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, no one is there. Whoa, you're like, whoa. So cute. Oh. Oh, my oh. Yep. Pumpkin. Did everybody get weighed? Yes, mommy will usually handle the poo uh, until they start eating solid food. But yes, they will eventually poo on their own if, if like, you're bottle feeding them. But uh, with the moms I've had, at least, they, they draw the line at solid food poo cleanup. <laughs> You're so cute. I'm gonna have to upgrade their digs soon. Which I think should be fine now that they've been they've actually been free range kittens now for I guess since yesterday. And they've stayed mostly in with occasional excursions, they stay mostly in at home base. So I would like to, I do need to vacuum at some, at some point and, um, oh, so cute. Vacuum and set up a better environment for them. Now that we, now that we've solved the mummy jumping open, oh, pretty. <laughs> Mommy jumping over the fence with kittens. She's totally not stressed or trying to find a new nest because it's. She, that's not what it is now. Now it's just moving a couple of babies around, rearranging babies. Um, hi, Pamie. You're so cute. Maybe I'll take a picture of. Oh, Pamie, that is. Look at that girl. Well, you guys can't see that. Hi, Mama. Hi there. Oh, your babies are so cute. I think it's going to be time to attempt the first, whoa, the first family portrait soon, too. So that will be fun. 
and it will be time. I have the I have the next size up of the universe. I need to put it together and get in here. Um. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. What is it? I had to. Um, the jungle kittens compromised the mailbox. Um, before they were cleared from the ringworm, so I uh, am not going to use it for these. I have it in quarantine, but I'm, I don't know. I'm worried about use. I'm not going to use it with these guys because I just, you know, <laughs> you imagine. No, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Oh, hi, sneaky snakes. Give me your little face, with both shield. Get your little face. What thing will make you? Hmm? Look at this pudgy pudge. Oh, someone got cup snake. Oh! <laughs> that was awesome. Uncouple these two. Because there's more fun stuff for me. Nobody's into the bowls yet. I guess the big, the bowl, this bowl is too big so far. Hey, mommy. Hey, mommy. Oops. Hey. What do you think about all this, mom? So, if you haven't yet, you should read. I shared um, something from Laps with a picture of a black kitten. Um, you should read about the crazy day crazy day they had, well, a couple of days. Um, someone actually sent two pregnant cats to lapse in a taxi. One of the, their sisters and one of them was in, was giving birth in the taxi. Um, and so obviously it was pretty stressed out. Um, and I haven't had a chance, I, I would love to go set up a camera there. Um, I haven't had a chance, but I would really like to. But you should read, go look at uh, Facebook, King Kitten's Facebook, and you'll see. What's going on? What happened? What are you doing? What's wrong? Oh, it's not a fuck. That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> I 
love when they prefer to use mummy glitter box. And it's so hard to get into. Val's in there now. Oh, and he's got litter on his nose. Oh, drops. You're so cute. They did have their hands full. Peggy was telling me when we were doing the broadcast, she had she told me that the one had just come in and they were really worried about the mom. Um but she's doing better now. Hi there. Oh that little face. Oh look at that little face. But maybe I'll have time to go by this weekend. That would be nice. I don't know. I don't know. It would be nice if I did. Hi, you're so handsome. Oh my goodness, look at the handsome kitten. Oh, look look at the milk bar happening over there. <laughs> Although it's not really a traditional milk bar, it's more like pralines attacking a tail, snickerdoodles attacking a foot. Val's nursing, pumpkins climbing. Hi, Sprinks. Oh, Sprinks. You're so cute. See, she's having none of the uh, biting at the milk bar. And who can blame her? Because she's got, they've got some serious teeth happening. Look at Pumpkin. I'm trying to get in there. Um, this kitten, kitten season has started early for us, for sure. We usually have our first ones born in, like, early March or mid-March. And it's, what, February. These guys are born in January, which is unheard of. I was expecting I wouldn't have kittens until probably March. But, sadly, not the case this year. So nice and relaxing to have your dinner with two, with two oranges trying desperately to nurse on you. Hey, no, don't do that. Nope, that's not for kittens. Oh, look at the praline. All right, I need to set up the camera so that we can catch the action. All right. Be a medical records mystery tonight. A woman opens a box mailed to her home to find the. If they aren't already. Pumpkin is still nursing. 
We're definitely going to get some baby nail looks. Is that your tummy? Goodness, what is going on? That was him. He's uh, he's dramatic. He's fine. He's just being dramatic. The tummy. Goofy. It's drama. It's drama sprinkle over there. Just wait till they have to poop for the first time. There's always um. There's always drama the first time they feel like they have to poop and they're not quite sure what to do. Oh, mommy, your babies are so hungry. <laughs> I need to get the kitten at the kibble on my car. Bring it up here. Oh, he's so cute. That's a face right there. Ooh, that's a face. Sprinkles. I need to post more pictures of Val. <laughs> Truffle decided to do a sneak attack on Mummy through the castle. I'm still waiting for the fluff to come out. I don't know. It doesn't look like we're going to have any really floofy kittens. I was thinking Praline would definitely be floofy, but maybe they'll be like mummy with the medium, medium hair. It doesn't really appear floofy until they get uh, all puffed up. We get truffle up there, waiting to cause trouble. All right, so I'm gonna go get the kitten kibble. Oh, look at the pretty chomping on her brother's. Okay. And Val's in the back, I see. Okay. All right. Oh. All right, I'll be back. Oh, look at this adorable. Pumpkin's like desperate for love car. I think we're definitely in weaning. 
Sugar Plum's actually the most uh, weaning mother I've had. Um, most of my other ones have just nursed and nursed and nursed and nursed. Oh, look at those ferocious preween kicks. All right, I'll be back. Food. 